What if you could turn this into that with zero 3D modeling experience? Here's how I did it. I used Messy AI, a tool that transforms text or images into 3D models. It's aimed at artists, designers and developers, and also people who like to make cool stuff. On the homepage, you can explore community-made models. Right away, you can see the potential. Let's start with Text to 3D. On the left, you can choose between Text to 3D or Image to 3D. In the prompt box, describe the model you want to generate. You can change AI model, you can leave it as it is. You can change license type and you also change symmetry settings. The key to getting great results, you need strong prompt. If you are not sure how to write one, just use another AI, like ChatGPT. Just write what model you want to generate. Then copy and paste the answer to prompt box. Every generation will take about 1 minute and cost 10 credits. And hit generate. On the right, you will see your generation history. Messi gives you four drafts to choose from. Select your favorite to continue. All four results are quite impressive. They are a little bit different in style and quality. If you are not happy, you can regenerate. Once you select your favorite, you can adjust the target polygon and enable texturing, which takes another 10 credits and about 1 minute. Texturing came out surprisingly good. You can edit or fix textures issues if needed. You also have control over poly count, either fixed or adaptive uh, with presets or custom values, and you can choose quads or triangles for topology. There are more things you can do. Meshi even supports animation. You just follow the guide and place a few markers. You need to place the markers like seen on the referred image. The results? Not bad. A bit weird leg movement, but tweaking the anchor points will improve it. It was generating 3D model from text. Now let's try generating from an image. The generation process is mostly the same, instead of typing a prompt, you upload the image. My first try didn't turn out great, not all images work well, but when I uploaded the cat image, I'm much better. The top two models look fantastic. The cat's texture even turned out better than the wolf's. Exporting your 3D models is super easy. Just click download, you can resize the model, set the origin and choose from 6 file formats. I will go with STL for 3D printing. But can you draw something and make it gen to generate 3D model? Let's find out. I sketched this masterpiece. Okay, not great, but let's see how Messi handles it. I will use phone to take a picture and then I can upload it into Messi AI. You can also use scanner to do it. These are the results. So I can see some good ones, one not so good and something strange. So the first one is quite good, but I think it had more like a dog than horse face. Second one is the best one. It's missing eyes, but it looks quite similar to what I drove. Third one has half missing. And the fourth one looks like horse and elephant had the child. I ran another text to 3D and got even better results this time. These models can be used in different places, like games or different animations. But can you 3D print these models? Let's find out. These models aren't optimized for 3D printing, so you will need to quite much supports. I used Auto 3 supports. Before printing, check your first layer. Some models have poor contact with the bed and it will fail printing. 
Easiest way to fix it is to move the mod a little bit down to get better first layer, and you can use Prim for better adhesion. First one is the wolf. This one didn't need very much supports and came out ok. Uh, cat was generated from the image and it looks also good. Details are ok, maybe I could have more details. I did dry text to 3D to generate a boat. It looks same style like 3D Benji, printed without supports and came out ok. The thing at the front is questionable. What should it be? This is the horse model sketch to 3D. I printed one smaller and other bigger. I like it. It came out great. It's missing eyes, but it's still very good results. Generating 3D model from drawing is impressive. And the Viking Warrior. It's the best one. It has good details. Didn't see issues. Printed also great. So, Messi AI can definitely create usable 3D models from both text and images. With good prompts or images, the results can be impressive. You can easily turn your sketches to 3D models without having 3D modeling skills. Even if you don't have skills for sketch, you can use text input to make your ideas into 3D models. Also, these models are 3D printable. You need to more supports than printing 3D models specially made for 3D printing, but you get still good results. Want to try Messi AI? You will find the link in the description. Drop a like if you found this helpful. Subscribe for more 3D printing videos and let me know in the comments what I should print or test next. Thanks for watching.